Hello there, and welcome to another edition of Rabbit Types, where we uh, look at your pictures of your rabbits, and uh, I tell you what breed you have. Uh, today I've got a very awesome uh, video because this is the probably when people are asking what breed my rabbit is, a lot of times they're asking about their lop, and a lot of times they're asking, is it a Holland lop? Is it a mini lop? Is it a dwarf lop? Is it a French lop? A uh, lop seems to uh, confuse people the most. And this is a textbook example. This is probably, I, I couldn't have planned it any better. Uh, Sandy sent me this picture of her two lops. And uh, let me go down to the uh, email real quick so that I can read that to you. And her email says, can you do, uh, can you do a video on our two lop bunnies, please. I know they are not French lops, velveteen lops, or English lops. I am thinking they are mini lops or holland lops, maybe. I don't think they are both the same breed either, as their ears are different and the size is different. And I've tried to figure it out using Google Images, but all the pictures there look the same for mini and holland lops. Poe is the white with black markings. He is um, one and a half years old and five and a half pounds. He has oval-shaped ears that reach just a bit past his chin, and a thick head with, bush, with pushed-in face. Also look like he's got a toupee as his hair atop his head is flat and light gray. Lily is the gray, or is she blue one? She is one year old, um, spayed, and three and a half pounds. Her ears were always tubular until last month when they flattened out at the bottom, but still are tubular when they meet her head. Her ears reach two to three inches past her chin. She also has a tiny head. Okay, so um, there are, um, off the top of my head, I should have checked before I started this video, I believe five recognized uh, breeds of lop. The French lop, the English lop, the mini lop, the holland lop, and the fuzzy lop. Uh, there is no such thing as a breed called the dwarf lop. Um, dwarf mini lop, any of that, um, no matter what they told you at the pet store, uh, usually it's the pet stores that tell you that. Uh, they tell you that so that you'll buy the bunny thinking that it's going to stay small. Um, and they're notoriously bad at knowing actually what, what breeds they have there in the store. So, um, so the five types of lops, uh, always know that the English lops have super, super long ears. Um, almost cartoonishly long. Um, they're very, very easy to identify. French lops are very, very large. We're talking about giant rabbits. Uh, 12 pounds and up, usually. If you get one that's 8 pounds, then it's malnourished. <laughs> they, they're they very, very large rabbits. Uh, the holland lops and the mini lops, fuzzy lops are pretty easy to tell because they got the big bushy hair. Uh, but Holland Lops and Mini Lops are the two that people get confused with the most. And uh, the reason that I started this video telling you this is a textbook example is, is the best way to tell a Mini Lop and a Holland Lop is to see the two together. And that's exactly what we have here. Um, I don't even really need to go to any of the other pictures. This is the perfect picture. So let's see. The... Um, uh, Poe is the white with black markings. Uh, his markings are what we call broken, and actually his particular style of markings is called Charlie. Um, called Charlie because of the Charlie Chaplin mustache that uh, Ch Charlies often have. He's only got half a one. Um, so he's a black Charlie, and he is a mini lop. Uh, mini lop ears tend to hang straight down just the way that his do. Now, now keep this in mind too. When you have a pure bred rabbit that was um, probably from show stock uh, and is a mini lop, it may look different from mini lops that have only been bred uh, for pets. There are people that breed rabbits just to sell them as pets. Uh, but if they were breeding for show, um, you're going to get what what Poe is. I mean, he's he's just a very nicely um, um, structured, I guess is the word, rabbit, uh, mini lot. The, um, probably the reason why the breeders did not keep him is he is a Charlie marking and that's not accepted in any of the shows. So rabbits like that tend to be the ones that are 
um, sold by breeders or the breeders sell them to pet stores. Uh, even if you have a rescue bunny, somebody probably bought that rabbit somewhere at, at first. And, um, you know, he, he was kind of um, put in that position because those markings are, are not accepted in the show ring. Um, doesn't make him any less of a bunny. He's a very cute bunny. Um, so so Poe is definitely a mini lop. Um, Lily, on the other hand, is definitely a Holland Lop, and you can see the size difference between the two of them. Lily is a little bit more flat to the ground, a little bit longer tubular body, um, but there are times when, when a Holland Lop and a Mini Lop will look exactly the same, and at those times the only way to tell the difference is with the weight. Uh, Lily is three and a half pounds. Uh, that's standard weight for Holland, between three and four pounds. Uh, four pounds is heavy for a Holland Lop. You're usually looking at around three pounds for a Holland Lop. Uh, mini Lops are five up to seven pounds. Uh, Poe is five and a half pounds. Lily is three and a half pounds. Game, set, match. There's, there's no confusion here. Uh, very, very clearly, Poe is a Mini Lop. Uh, Lily is a Holland Lop. Um, the the problems that you get is when you have a rabbit that looks like it could be a mini lop, or maybe it kind of looks like a Holland Lop. Sometimes they carry both traits, and it's four and a half pounds. That's when we get confused because it could either be a really big Holland Lop or a really small mini lop. And without knowing any more history, uh, those can sometimes be impossible to tell especially if the body types are kind of crossing over one breed to the other. Holland Lops are um, a, a dwarf breed. Mini Lops are not. So Holland Lops, it's, the breed is not called dwarf. The breed is called Holland Lop. But they do carry a dwarf gene, which is what makes them smaller uh, than the Mini Lop. And even though uh, Mini Lop has the word mini in it, they are not small rabbits, five to seven pounds typically. And again, this is where a lot of confusion happens. A pet store sells it to somebody and says, oh yeah, it's a mini lop. They'll stay really small. It's not true. Unless you have a Holland lop, uh, your, your mini lop's going to get pretty darn big. Um, so again, five breeds of rabbits. English lop, French lop, uh, mini lop, Holland lop, fuzzy lop. Uh, mini lops are between five to seven pounds. Um, I tend to think they look like puppies. I, I think that this picture, he definitely looks like a puppy. Uh, Holland Lops are much smaller. Normally their ears are a little bit shorter. Lily's ears are a little bit long, but um, they, they tend to be shorter and they don't lay quite as flat as what you can see. Poe's ears are laying straight down. Um, but Lily is definitely a Holland Lop. Holland Lops are between three to four pounds on the big side and um, they tend to be a little bit longer, smushed in face. Both the Mini and the Holland will have uh, more of a smushed in face. So I hope that gives you a little bit more clarity when it comes to lops. And um, you know, if you have a rabbit at home, if you have a lop that's four and a half pounds, good luck. But if it's over five pounds, most likely a Mini Lop. Under four pounds, most likely a Holland Lop. And of course, give and take if your rabbit is uh, severely over or underweight. Uh, but if it's at normal weight, that, that should be a good guide for you. Um, if you have questions about your rabbits, if you would like me to take a look at some pictures of your rabbits and guess the breed, uh, kind of diagnose what breed we have, then send me the pictures. Oh yeah, real quick, um, uh, Sandy was asking uh, about the color of Lily. Lily is a blue, by the way, Sandy. Um, she is a, a blue Holland Lop, and uh, Poe is a broken Charlie, broken black Charlie mini Lop. Uh, again, Charlie being that the spots on his body cover less than 25% of his body. Uh, so Lily's a blue Holland Lop, and Poe is a broken, char broken black Charlie, uh, I don't know how you would say it, but a, a black Charlie mini Lop. Uh, but if you'd like to send me pictures of your rabbit, uh, you can send them to the email address that will pop up at the end of this video. Uh, send me, <coughs> excuse me, send me pictures along with uh, weights of the rabbits, uh, how old they are, whether they're babies or adults, 
uh, how old they are at the time you took the picture, what country you're from, because that does make a difference as well. And um, also, I need to know um, what breed you think it is, or what breed maybe the pet store told you, or the rescue told you, or your buddy next door thinks it is. Because sometimes that gives me a, a few extra clues without seeing the rabbits in person. Um, sometimes other people's guesses will give me a clue. All right, uh, thank you very much, Sandy, for sending these pictures in, and we'll see you in the next video.